guys, it's Carlos the Ultimate Fitness Trainer once again and thank you so much for watching the video and today we're doing a video about the misinterpretation of hard work. Now, a lot of us think about hard work being really, really hard work and uh, being extremely hard work and extremely hard work and the work goes on extremely hard work without realizing there's got to be some sort of structure, strategy, and intelligence behind the hard work. Because if you just work hard without realizing where you're going, you become a very much of a busy fool. And it could be sometimes uh, almost interpreted as like a bull in a china shop. So you've got to be very, very, very careful because sometimes just the hard work in itself, it's not just what you need to do. You need to be obviously structured, you need to have strategy, you need to be around the right people, you need to be able to understand that in order to get what you really want to get, um, it cannot be misinterpreted. Okay, now let me just get one here for you guys, and this is gonna start with rule number one. Make sure you work hard. Now, make sure you really have the engine to get going, to get going. So you need the engine. So you like a car, it doesn't matter how powerful the car is or how, how great tires it has, uh, or the interior, the aerodynamics, anything. It needs to have the right engine to keep moving, okay? Now then this leads to number two. You've got to make sure that your strategy, meaning the plan in order for you to get going and for you to keep moving needs to be articulated around the goal that you need to achieve. What I mean by that is you must have the right structure in place in order to achieve your goal. Because otherwise, no matter how strong your engine is, you will break down. You need to have that car, if you like, going back to the example of a car, you need the car serviced, it needs to be MOT. You need, to, in order to keep going, so the strategy is right, and you achieve your results, then this leads into number three, consistency. Consistency. You need to be consistent, day in, day out. Yes, it's, there's gonna be rainy days. Yes, there's gonna be really, really good days, but remember, is how you deal with the bad days, because a lot of us can deal with good days all day, okay? But it's the bad days, is how you really overcome and become your greatest version with those bad days. Now then, this leads into number four, is learn by making mistakes. Don't be afraid. In order to keep the momentum going um, and keep getting results, you need to learn. You need to learn with bad times. You need to learn the lessons. Uh, failing to learn the lessons, and if you are one of them guys that thinks you know it all and you're never wrong and you always do it right, you are making a big mistake because we all, no matter how great we are, you speak to anyone that amount to anything, they made loads of mistakes. But those guys have done it so, 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 so many times and they learned with those mistakes and became their greatest versions. Hence the reason why they are where they are. Call it luck, call it whatever you like. Success is not a matter of luck. There might be some luck sometimes to a degree, an element of, of luck. I mean, even us being here, so we've been lucky, we've been gifted. So there's always an element of luck. But what it is, is, is that relentless hard work, day in, day out, bad days, good days, not so good days, and they keep the momentum going. And then number five is put all that shit together and run with it. Get the relentless attitude, get the desire, get the plan, get the strategy, get the right people around you, get the positivity, become your greater self, believe in yourself, keep away from haters, and make sure you deliver and get the results that you still want for. So there you are, another video for you guys. As I keep saying guys, there's no perfect videos, there's no perfect days, I just keep producing, whether there's good days, bad days, mediocre days, I keep the momentum going. And that's a metaphor that I always use in order to become my greatest self. I'm not the best, I'm just the best I can be. And with all that said, guys, thanks so much for visiting me on uh, Instagram, which is Carlos Trainer. 
10. Uh, also, thank you to obviously the guys that subscribe, subscribe to the channel on YouTube, which is Color Strainer. And uh, obviously, all the guys, please, if you can, subscribe to my channel on, on, on Color Strainer on YouTube. And also, follow me on Instagram, which is Color Strainer 10. And with all that said, guys, stay happy, stay healthy, stay fit. Have a great day. Take care.